Hi, this is Chaitanya Mandadi from ANH iSecure Private Limited. As part of this presentation, we are going to be discussing how we can use Cybrax Privileged Account Security Solution to secure Identity IQ's SP admin account. We will begin by briefly understanding Cybrax Privileged Account Security Solution. Following this, we will take a look at the use case which is uh, securing of the SP admin account. Finally, we will understand the approach taken to implement this use case. Let us start by understanding the phrase privileged account security one word at a time. Security implies that we are securing or safeguarding something. In this case, we are safeguarding accounts and not just all accounts, we are focused on safeguarding and providing security mechanisms on privileged accounts. CyberArk's solution consists of various components. As part of this slide, we will take a look at the major and the most relevant components to our current use case. The vault is at the core of CyberArk's solution. It provides a secure storage for the accounts and the configuration details. The central policy manager provides policies on how privileged accounts are managed, how often their passwords are changed, how often they are verified, what are the type of platforms and so on. The password vault web access is a way of connecting to Cyberax solution via a web browser. The privilege session manager initiates sessions to target machines from within Cyberax solution so that it can be managed, monitored and audited if required. Next, we will understand the current use case. Identity IQ without a privileged account security solution is available for the users to log in directly. This is also applicable for privileged account users like SP admin or any other user with the system administration capabilities. This is however not a secure way of logging in. In this scenario, we can use CyberArk solution to manage the privileged account. And when a user wants to initiate a session as a system administrator, to Identity IQ. First, they need to authenticate themselves with CyberArk, which will then initiate a privileged session and provide it to the user. We need to perform two configurations on CyberArk to allow it to connect to Identity IQ and manage the SP admin account. First, we need to define a platform. The platform contains details of the type of application CyberArk is connecting to. In this case, Identity IQ is defined as a website type of platform. The platform also contains how the processes of verification and change of password need to be carried out and how often they should be done. Next, we need to set up a connection component which defines 
how the privilege session manager will initiate the connection to identity iq now let us take a look at the overview of this implementation on cyber accent we have the central policy manager and the privilege session manager which are connected to the platform definition and the connection component definition we also have the password vault web access component onto which the user will log on and perform the necessary actions the cpm talks to identity iq over http for the password management tasks of verification or change and when the user wants to initiate a session using privilege session manager these sessions are done over rdp please follow us on our social media for more technical content thank you